Hey guys, Denise Salcedo here for Red Carpet Report, and today we're at the Beverly Hills Four Seasons for the 2015 Media Access Awards, celebrating awareness and disability and inclusion in media and entertainment. Princess, so tell us a little bit about your ballroom dancing and what it is that you do. Okay. So hi, my name is Marissa Hamamoto. I'm a professional ballroom dancer. I'm also founder and artistic director of Infinite Flow, which is America's first professional wheelchair ballroom dance company. And the reason why I created the dance company is I used to be paralyzed from the neck down myself with a rare spinal cord disease called spinal cord infarction. And, but today I'm on my feet back dancing and um, as a way of giving back my love for dance, I decided to create a wheelchair dance company um, so that people who continue to live with paralysis get to enjoy and experience dancing. So let me ask you, you were paralyzed from the neck down. How is it that things changed for you? It was a definite shock that I suddenly became paralyzed. It came out of nowhere. It was a disease, not an accident. Um, and, you know, the doctor told me that I may never be able to recover, uh, but I was able to physically recover. And though the psychological recovery took a little bit more time, um, I continued to fight through it. And, and, and I would say during that entire journey, um, my, I became a stronger person. I became a lot more appreciative of life and an appreciative of dance and my body and that appreciation. And then now, you know, I was able to, you know, achieve my dream of becoming a professional dancer. And I mean, with that said, it was very natural for me to want to give back my passion and my love for dancing. And you know, that's the good thing about the Media Access Awards today is that you had the love of dancing and then we have other people who have the love of acting. What was it like for you? What kind of stories do you have about people that you have helped inspire to chase their dreams for ballroom dancing that are currently in wheelchairs? Um, through, uh, through definitely you know, teaching, how to how, uh, teaching people how to dance in wheelchairs, um, I've d actually discovered that they're capable of a lot. And that just because you have a disability doesn't mean that you're limited in what you can do. And it's also inspired me to want to give more opportunities to those who have disabilities. And this is why I'm here today at the Media Access Awards, um, because I want to support the cause. Can you tell people how they can be a part of Infinite Flow? Yes, uh, so to find Infinite Flow, go to www.infiniteflowdance.org. Uh, we're looking for volunteers. We're definitely looking for donations and supporters and partners. Uh, you, you know, we, uh, if you go to our website, you'll find a lot of information. And yes, please just contact me at the number and the email address on the website. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much, Marissa, for giving us all this information and for, you know, starting something like this. That's very important to everybody. Thank you so much, and I hope you have enjoy your day today. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you guys for watching our coverage of the 2015 Media Access Awards. In the comments below, let us know who inspires you the most, and make sure to like this video and subscribe.